This is the game of Faker vs RJS this morning. Who won? I actually haven't seen this video. This is my first, my first reading, first viewing. RJS versus Faker. NA's most hyped mid laner up against the GOAT. You should have had our names turned off and then we could guess who is Faker. That would have been good, but now it's too late. Is this live? This is from this morning, but nobody's seen it. Because you can't stream during Champions Q and no one recorded it. I'm the only one. I'm the only living survivor with the recording. I made it out. Ouch. I don't know the results. I haven't, I haven't pre-watched it. Out of all streams, Champions Q? No, you cannot. During Worlds, no one can stream Champions Q. Do you understand? Listen to me, boy. Or JJ streams it. No, he doesn't. You don't understand what I'm trying to tell you. During the world's broadcast, this game occurred. During the world's broadcast, no one is allowed to watch Champions Q. You understand? You cannot stream it. You cannot show it. This game was during worlds. Okay. What's coming out of your keyboard right now is not correct. Holy RJS! Wait a minute, I think Faker might. No, Faker no flash. Sedja Jawani should be able to finish. Right? Right? No shot, Faker lives. He can't live. Ulti executes himself. Yeah, he's, he's done. Into the tower. And he'll TP back in the mid lane. It's actually not even that bad for Faker. Why can they not stream it? Because they're not allowed. Oh, Cody Sun's playing. But why do you think Riot doesn't let the players stream Champions Q during the world's broadcast. Like it's just, it's a no brainer. They want, they want the views on the main broadcast. That's just the rules guys. The sponsors and stuff would be angry. Just, you should be able to self diagnose this with your own brain. That's why this game has never been shown before until this moment. Do you understand? Where are the actual intelligence chatters? Are you here? Are they, are they around somewhere? I'm right here. I'm here. There they are. Finally. RJS ultimate. RJS kills Faker. Well played by Hyper. Good good little camp he's setting up here. JDG secret bot lane pick. Ashheimer. It could be good. I don't know. Who wins do you think, chat? Yone or Azir? I think Yone does... A good Yone should be able to do fine into an Azir. Like, Azir counters Yasuo, but Yone has, like, extra dash mechanics that are fucking bullshit. Oh, Faker. Almost gets a solo. Jeez, that was aggressive. What the hell is going on down there? Action. Another swing. There we go, baby. Who do you reckon's gonna win this? Blue or red side? I have a feeling hope and missing just perma f just perma gape Cody Sun smoothie, I'll be honest, in the late game. Like that is that is a bit of a gap. Probably too much of a gap. Baker is he dead again? RJS? Boom! Gets a second kill on the faker. Thumbs up emote! There you are. Oh shit. Cody son. <laughs> Graves yoink. That's such bullshit. Maybe his faker should retire? Come on guys. But yes, RJS did go 21-0 against Knight yesterday. Let's see what he goes against Faker today. Trophy tomorrow maybe. Why is Hope running it? How come you're running it, boyo? Stop it. You think top esports are done? I think it looking it looks very worrisome for top esports, yes. 
Oh shit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Nice fake up. on cancelling spring split and having tournament circuits to replace it? I don't like it. RJS? Oh shit. Shut down over to the Siva. Cody son. Baker in the side. Oh, well played, well played, well played. Do you think we'll get the 018 mid beast? Yeah. I do. I reckon it's actually going to happen. Like, I think it's more probable at this point. What do the mathematics tell us? It probably tells us that it's more likely that NA get a win. Like, uh, the probability is probably, it's there's still a chance. They got, what, nine games left. Most games, there's, there's like maybe one 50-50 game, another one's that are like 90-10. Mathematically, I think if you like you went to like some probability scientist, that's eventually gonna get that there should be a win. Like at least one. It's not guaranteed though. Wait. Baker just solo 1v2 to RJS. And he's not scared. Oh no. That was a bit that was a bit aggressive, buddy. Nice flash. Ooh, into the alt? No! Graves, he's serious. The beast, even if you think every remaining match for NA is 10% chance of win, the chance of them going all nine without a win would be around 40%. Every remaining match isn't 10% chance, though. I think that CFO one's like 60 40 or something. That puts the odds actually kind of high, above 50%. I know how maths works. Don't worry about it. RJS versus Cody son. Oh, but Daddy Faker shows up with the cock block. Well played, and he's gonna flank. No, he's not. He's gonna TP back to me to get farm. Oh shit! Oh shit! Faker. Faker, you're gonna die. Don't die. He's dead. Dead EG bot lane with the double, but Faker eats up hope. Dead even gold between blue and red. It's gonna be a good game. I think Riot should allow the LCS to start all Worlds games with a thousand gold lead to make it even. Because I think I think then we might actually have a bit of a competition on our hands. Not enough, maybe 3,000. How about all tier ones destroyed? Reckon NA with all tier ones destroyed versus JDG or Rogue that they would win. There's actually a chance. I mean, it, that's a lot of towers though. But maybe that. I don't know what it's like to start a game with no tier tier two tier tier, tier ones. Maybe it's a benefit. RJS versus Faker solo. Who wins? RJS solo kill Faker. What are you saying? NA doesn't have any talent. RJS versus Faker 1v1. Faker pops the ultimate. RJS catches him out. Q lands, takes him out. Bing bong. Bob's your uncle. This is the future right here. Kick out all these import mids. What are we doing? Put in a little bit of local meat into the mix. This vital guy's action is always a bit of a flip. Hey, maybe how's Oceania doing? Shut up, bro. Let me have my fucking moment. Like he's chilling side. He's going for this tower, dude.
If NA goes 0 18, should Professional League of Legends be outlawed in the US? I think it's only fair, yeah. Oh, Faker Stoppy. Does he have ult? He does. Is he going to use it? He's not. Triple kill. There he is. Here's the big dog. Here's the big dog. Wait. What the hell is going on over here? Oi! Shut down. Faker. You got a thousand gold dude, over RJS here. Faker is here is not one you want to give a lead to, I'll tell you this much. I just sat in that bush for like six seconds. Huh? RJS is gone. When FIFA stream? I don't know how. I don't have a console or controllers or anything. Ouch. Maybe, did you see these Korean Grandmaster Challenger players? They played Nyla and Lee mid and top and flash enemy base to proxy two waves to get a huge lead. Send it to send me a clip of or of their names right now. RJS, huge engage. Kappa. Baker, huge engage. Kappa. These two mids, man. When one ints, the other follows. Respect. All right, RJS, come on. Blutch it up, baby. Blutch it up. There we go. Boys are turning online. Baker. Oh, good combo. Action. Action with the Revies. Oh, Cody Sun drops. Wait, Faker can just kill them all. Faker gets one. He gets two. Looking for the third. Is he able to get it? He can set up three sand shoulders. He picks up all three of them. Triple kill. Faker zips over the back of the pit. Should be a free Nash for blue side as they take the gold lead. Stop it, Ash. Stop it, Ash. Stop embarrassing yourself. They could build Leandries into Hourglass into Nash Horse. The Beast, I can't believe you taught Faker how to play League. It is pretty unbelievable, I know. Hey, suit. Okay. This Karma shielding is absolutely cracked. RJS has to flash. She doesn't quite go down, though. Fucking hell, that Fiora damage. Faker with the ultimate. He's not able to get out. And he will go down and give a bounty over. Who's going to eat it, though? The Fiona. He fucking hurts. RJS has two items. Faker has three and a half. 12,000 gold to 10,000. Only 2.5k gold lead. Just these, I guess, I is expensive. Hey, Mid Beans, do you play League anymore? No, I always have the end of the season off as I watch Worlds. I think I've been doing this last three years. A Fiora build is nutty. Yeah, it's a little bit crazy. Might be necessary against action. I don't know. Time for Europe. And Oceania as well to rise up. It's our time. Us and EU. We've got to stop associating ourselves with NAOs. We're EU now. We used to be EU, guys. Think about it. I don't know why. Like, why have they put us in with the NA players? We're EU, man. Didn't like we were from, like, we were from, like, Britain and they kicked us out of something before. Like, you know, they sent us, like, prisoners over to Australia. Like, we're part of EU. Let us back in. I'm good. I'm good at playing as well.
the final fight. One Faker versus one RJS, but he's dead. Arrow hits, someday. Cody son, Faker, just shouting names, who's gonna win? Ult comes out. Faker, finish the Nash, finish the Nash. Lane Baron Nasher. Faker TP. Now Faker try to go end, I think. Death cap on death cap on these, yeah. RGS, one final attempt to save the game. He's not able to do it. He goes down. Baker, one. RJS, nil. NA, just taking L's on L's on L's on L's. This fucking week.